Hello, welcome to Vipramind channel. Today in this session, we are going to see one of the trick to divide any number by any another number that end with 9. That is the divisor will be nothing but a number that ends with 9. For example, 19, 29, 39, 79, 89, 119 and so on. So how we can divide any other number by the such type of numbers. So if you are going to divide these numbers like for example 3 divided by 29, 6 divided by 79. So it, by traditional method it will take more time and uh, so we are going to see a Vedic math technique how we can divide such numbers in a very easy way. Just learn this technique and apply in uh, take number of examples so it will become more easier for you and you can solve such type of question within a second. So it will be very helpful in competitive examination as well as in your school examinations. So what you have to do, we will find out the solution for <coughs> this division by Vedic mathematics technique. So what you have to do here is the technique, please learn the technique and then you can take multiple number of examples. So it will be more easier for you to solve this type of question within a few seconds. So what you have to do here is, it's 3 divided by 29. So the first step that you have to do here is, 3 divided by, increase this denominator by 1. So it will be 30. Now the next step here is, next step, remove this 0 from the denominator and shift the point or decimal on the left hand side by 1 digit. So right now the decimal is here after 3. And after 3 is 0, 0. So we are not putting a decimal. So actually the decimal point is right after 3. So we'll shift on the left hand side by 1 digit. So right now we have 1 digit only. So it will be 0 0.3 divided by 3. So remove the 0 and shift the point in the numerator by 1 decimal. So now is 0 0.3 divided by 3. Now the next step that you have to do here is divide this 0 0.3 by 3 and you have to write the answer in a question and remainder form. So now 0 divided by 3 will be 0 point after that. After this what you have to do is now 3 divided by 3. So what is 3 divided by 3 by traditional method if you throw 3 divided by 3, 3 into 1, 3. So remainder is 0. So you have to write in the format of question and remainder. So what is question 1, remainder is 0. Now next step. Now again you have to divide the next number by 3. So you have to just keep on dividing because all these numbers are non-terminating but recurring form. So if you want to find out the uh, uh, for example uh, answer up to 3 decimal, 4 decimal or 5 decimal, you can keep on doing the same steps that we are going to use here. So for example you want to find out up to 4 to 5 dec uh, decimal places. So just take the example now 1, 0. So now next number that you have to divide by 3 is 0, 1. You have to take in this way 0, 1. So 0, 1 is nothing but 1. Now if you divide 1 by 3, so what is, so 1 doesn't goes in 3 stables. So I take 0. So 0, remainder will be 1. So question is 0, remainder is 1 when you divide 1 by 3. Now next step, again you have to divide the next number that is 1, 0, that is 10. 10 divided by 3. What is 10 divided by 3? If you take 10 divided by 3, so 3 into 3, 9. Remainder is 1. So 3 into 3, 9. Remainder is 1. So you have to write 3 here. Question that is question here and remainder here. Next step. Now what you have to divide the next number is 13. 1, 3. That is 13. So 3 into 4. 3 into 4 is 12. 3 into 4 is 12. Remainder will be 1. Then next number is 14 divided by 3. So 3 into 4 is 12 because if you divide 14 by 3, so 3 into 4 is 12, remainder will be 2. So 3 into 4 is 12 and remainder is 2. Next is, next number is 24. So 24 that is 3 into 8 is 24, remainder is 0. Next number is 0, 8 that is 8 divided by 3. So just keep on doing this. Now so if you want to find out up to 3 or 4 decimal places, so what will be your answer? What will be the answer for 3 divided by 29? So answer will be nothing but this value. That is 0 0.103448 and so on. So we have 
found out up to certain decimal places you can just keep on doing this so this is the answer if you divide 3 divide by 29 the same procedure we are going to follow here so example 8 divided by 49 so 8 divided by 49 will be what 8 increase it by 1 so it will be 50 next step what you have to do remove this 0 and shift the point on the left hand side by one digit so it will be 0 0.8 divided by 5 now next is 0 divided by 5 0 point so now you have to divide 8 by 5 and write in the question and remainder form so 8 divided by 5 so if you divide 8 by 5 so 5 into 1 5 remainder will be 3 remainder will be 3 that is 8 divided by 5 so 5 into 5 remainder will be 3 now the next number that you have to divide is 31 so 31 in 5 table 5 into 6 30 remainder will be what 1 the next number is 16 5 into 2 sorry 5 into 3 that is 15 15 5 into 3 15 remainder is 1 next number that you have to divide is 13 so 13 will be 5 into 2 is 10 5 into 2 is 10 remainder will be 3 next number that you have to divide is 32 32 will be what 6 5 into 6 30 30 remainder will be what 2 and so on just keep on doing this <laughs> you'll get the answer so answer what will be the answer will be 0 0.16326 and so on you'll keep on doing this you'll get a recurring term after particular value hope you have understood now now it will become more easier if you take more number of examples now we'll take one more example here 6 divided by 79 so what do you have to do 6 divided by 79 increase it by 1 is 80 now next step remove the 0 and put here it will be 0 0.6 divided by 8 now next is 0 divided by 8 is 0 then point after that you have to divide 6 by 8 now 6 divided by 8 so 6 does not goes in a stable so what we are going to take 0 0 so 0 so remainder will be 6 so 0 6 remainder is 6 now the next number that you have to divide is 6 0 that is 60 so 60 8 into 7 8 into 7 is 56 remainder is 4 remainder is 4 so now next number that you have to divide is 47 8 into 5 8 into 5 because 8 into 6 is 48 that is greater 8 into 5 that is 40 remainder is 7 next is next number that you have to divide 75 so 8 into 9 remainder is 3 so it's 39 then 8 into 4 32 because 8 into 5 is 40 that is greater so 8 into 4 that is 32 remainder is 7 next number that you have to divide is 74 so just keep on dividing and your answer will be nothing but this that is if you divide 6 6 divided by 79 will be nothing but 0 0.07594 and so on just keep on doing and you'll get a recurring term after a certain value so this is very easy and it's a simple division that you you have to divide just by one digit number so it's 6 divided by 8 then uh, 6 divided by uh, 60 divided by 8 47 by divided by 8 75 divided by 8 and your answer will be this one that is the question one so this is how you can divide any number by the numbers that end with 9 so hope it is uh, helpful for you and hope you have understood and if still you have any doubt you can write in a comment section we are going to uh, upload more videos on such tricks and even next video we are going to take another examples that if you have certain number and if you want to uh, convert it into numbers that end with 9 so we'll take the examples in the next video hope it will be helpful for, uh, help, <coughs> helpful for you please subscribe our channel for more videos thank you